A good proposal has value for money. It has a strong case. It doesn't necessarily mean it needs to be disease focused. We encompass an awful lot of underpinning research. It is this balancing act between being ambitious but being achievable, but also likely to result in a step change in our thinking, perhaps. A good application comes through experience, through building that track record, but also the environment. So, you know, the, the university, the, the school, the faculty, and, and um, the colleagues you have, the, um, the facilities that, that are provided by the research organisation, the support from the research organisation is really key as well. You're judging the person. The second thing is place because they're judging where the young person goes and that's also in a fellowship as well. And the third is obviously the project, but all three are important. Also for a young person it's important where you went, right? Is it the right place to do this sort of science? If you're interested in working as I was on stem cell biology or early development, then you want to go to a place where all the resources and infrastructure and that you have great colleagues get great feedback for that area and the panel will be really impressed by this. The letter of support from your head of department is really important because if they don't believe in you, why should we? Um, but more practically, what we want to see is that they've really thought about you as an individual and your career aspirations and how they and us are going to help together to help your career move forward. Your department really has to sign up to support you. And so they have to be willing to put in the time to write a letter that is specifically about your career and your career trajectory. And they have to agree to put their money where their mouth is.